how can you coach your team as a scrum master to make your retro really shine and awesome? So this is for the teams I was working with downtown Boston this week. I want to share uh, several things you could, you could do next time to make it really shine. It was an awesome retro, right? There were, uh, the team members were engaged. They had the three columns, what went well, what we could do differently, and the takeaways to improve for next time. And here are a few thoughts about how you can uh, take it to the next level. The first thing, when you ask the three questions, let teams sit down for three, four minutes and capture ahead of time their thoughts about the improvement, about what went well. Because otherwise, as you go through the circle, people are reluctant to share once they've heard something similar to what they were thinking. And if they capture it in writing, you make sure that they'll all contribute. So that's the first thing. The second thing, uh, make sure when you have a list of seven things to improve, you do dot voting to figure out what is the team most passionate about rather than as a scrum master narrating what you think the most important thing is. Let the team shine, let the team work together to do dot voting and say this is the one thing we want to improve for next time rather than, oh, I think this is what we need to improve. So let the team own the process. And the third thing, when there is a silence, and sometimes there is a silence, the Scrum Master might feel too compelled to fill the silence, and actually it's the other way around. Silence is golden. Let the Scrum Master ask the question, hey, what's going on? Um, have we touched on all the important points? Can we improve on what we're doing, right? So rather than feeling compelled at the Scrum Master and a coach to fill the silence, Work on the silence. Silence is golden. So three things, right? First and foremost, let people think ahead of time what they're going to contribute. The second thing is make sure you dot vote on the improvements and select one to put in your backlog for the next sprint to improve. And the third thing, silence and golden. Silence is golden. Um, inviting you to uh, add your thoughts down if you have your other thoughts. Um, more links down below, and I'll see you next time.